Okay, guys, welcome to part two. Uh, one thing that I forgot to tell you is, like, whenever we're calling upon the spiritual hierarchy of Earth for help, uh, I forgot to, to send it up their chain of command, because that, that's what makes it so much more powerful. So what you want to do is say, Beloved Mother, Father, God, Mighty I Am Presence, Great Ascended and Angelic Host, and Great Cosmic Beings, and the entire Kingdom of Light and Love from the Great Central Sun. Please send forth trillions and trillions and trillions of oceans and oceans and oceans of the highest frequency of love and the highest form of light and the sacred fires of purification and the violet flames and the platinum light and positive life force energy directly into the heart chakra of the president, the Supreme Court, the Congress and the Senate and all the way up their chain of command in such a way they cannot defend against. Please send it directly into the heart chakra of the President, the Supreme Court, the Congress, and the Senate, and all the way up their chain of command in such a way they cannot defend against. And what that's going to do is send it into all of them, send it all the way up their chain of command, and not only does it Whenever you send it into their leaders, it affects their whole body. So it affects every single dark being that is attacking us. It's going to affect them. And our intent is to turn them from dark to light. You know, let that always be, you know, state your intent, like why you're doing this. You know, I'm doing this because I want to convert them from dark to light so that they will feel love and become love and their hearts would be changed and, you know, they won't be so evil. So... That's that's what you want to do as many times as you can a day. Um, it's if man if it says on that one website the we, the wire that twelve percent of Americans know that the government is run by reptilians. Okay, if twelve percent of us was doing this, um, the golden age would get here such quicker because they're only here because we're unconscious and they would take advantage of that fact. When enough of us wake up and we fight back, they hate light and love. They hate it. They will flee from it. They will run. They will jump, literally jump in their ships and take off running. If half of humanity, even if we're just half of us sending them light and love, they would burn off because, you know, they hate it. So the only way that they stay in power is to keep people stupid, to keep people dumb, and to keep people not fighting them so that they can just eat and destroy us, okay? We can't let that happen. So please, do this as much as you can every day. You know, every time I'm in the store and I see, a, 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 I see the Queen of England, I see President Barack Obama, whenever I see any of them that are in these people magazines and that are all over our, you know, newspapers and magazines, I send them light and love. I look at it and I say, I send you oceans and oceans of light and love. I send you oceans and oceans of light and love. And um, they hate it. And they know that once there's enough of us that are awake like this and that we're doing that, just sending them light and love, sending them light and love, it, not only does it cause them to be changed, but they hate it and they won't, they don't want to stay on a planet where this is being done to them. You know, the only way that they're getting away with it is because it's a secret. You know, they're, they're being, them being here on earth and controlling the earth and our governments, you know, it's all, um, a secret and I can tell you just from my personal dealings with them these past five years or so okay they've been attacking me they are the most disgusting evil vile wicked things you know in creation um, honestly I don't even know how God grants them life how they're even given you know why they're given the the reason to be here but what I can tell you what's been shown to me through my higher self is that um, it's an evil that's allowed it's allowed to be because for a greater good you know um, and, and that greater good is it's like this is you have to go through hardships and you have to go through trials to become something greater um, for your light to be greater at the end that's really what this whole thing is it's like when, when before we start this path, you know, we, we have attained so much light in our in our experience and our spiritual evolution. But then when you go through periods of darkness and you go through you know really hard times and trials and tribulations, um, and then you come out of that, then your light is even brighter. Your light is even brighter than before, and that's the whole that's the whole point. 
that's why they're allowed to exist and that's why uh, these this spiritual evolution happens and in the end it's just so that our light can be great and bright and we always win in the end we always win that's why they always says the light of God never fails uh, this process that this planet is going through every single planet has to go through it all the beings on the planet has to go through it it's just a normal process now the more of us get involved with doing things like this and saying decrees and gifting organite and just trying to make the earth a better place the sooner we achieve what we're trying to achieve uh, the less of us that are doing that and we're watching TV and we're not doing anything or just being stagnant or you know worries me just being depressed not doing nothing the longer they're gonna be in control the longer they're going to have the control. So it's up to us. It's in our hands how fast we want our freedom. So I was going to tell you, you send it into their heart chakra. That's one way. Now also, there's my pen. Write it here. Hold on, I'm going to write something down. Energy stream. Everything, everything has an energy stream. I have an energy stream. We as a human race have an energy stream. The earth has an energy stream. The reptilians have an energy stream. Uh, the forces of darkness have an energy stream, okay? Everything is an energy stream. Now, whenever like a group of reptilians are attacking you or a, the dark forces that are attacking the earth and all life on earth, they all have an energy stream, right? Whenever you send love into their energy stream, it stops them from being predatory, from be coming after you and wanting to kill you. It like basically disrupts them and doesn't let them do their evil works. So another very important thing you can do is say something like this. Beloved Mother, Father, God, Mighty I Am Presence, Great Ascended and Angelic Host and Great Cosmic Beings, and the entire Kingdom of Light and Love from the Great Central Sun, please send trillions and trillions and trillions of oceans and oceans and oceans of the highest frequency of love directly into the energy stream of the dark forces attacking the earth and all life on earth. Please send it directly into the energy stream of the dark forces that are attacking the earth and all life on earth. Or you can say, please send it directly into the energy stream of all reptilians on earth. Please send it directly into the energy stream of all evil reptilians on earth. Or you can say, please send it directly into the energy stream if you're being attacked. Please send it directly into the energy stream of the entities attacking me. Please send it directly into the energy stream of the entities attacking me. And you'll see that it stops them from you know coming after you and trying to harm you because that's the power of love love is the power that stops them that's why we always win and they always lose is because we have that power and they don't have it and their hope is that you never figure out that love beats them love beats all the harp their technologies love beats everything anything you can think of that they can come up with to throw at us love cancels it out and doesn't let it work so that is very important sending love into the energy stream of you know evil reptilians on earth the the government you know the people who work in government everything has an energy stream and if you send love into it you'll see that it disrupts them so that's what you want to do guys